Fishing around here ain't what it used to be. That's what you hear from a lot of the old timers and most of the places you end up fishing at. They hit you with a classic back in my day, talking about how big the fish used to be and how many amazing days of fishing they used to have. But sadly, that's a reality for a lot of us. Our home waters are not producing the amount of quality fish that they did decades ago. But that doesn't mean that all hope is lost. There is still a place that you can find in the United States to experience what some are calling the good old days. I joined a saltwater sportsman adventure to experience this place for the first time. A place where the fishing pressure is low with a seemingly endless environment for different species to thrive in. A place where you can still find large numbers of quality fish that are all ready to annihilate your bait. And that place is Venice, Louisiana. Got him, got him right there. He got him, look at that! <laughs> Got it. That's a big one. Here's that big one. Yes, sir. Got it right there. What? Got him. Got one. Double. This is a very large redfish, guys. This journey began with a short hour and a half flight from Tampa to New Orleans, where from there, it was another two hour drive to our new home base at the Redfish Lodge of Louisiana. A family owned fishing lodge nestled in the world famous fishing town of Venice, Louisiana, known for its fleet of shrimp boats and amazing fishery, there is nothing else to do here besides fish, eat, and drink. Captain Mike Frenette, the owner, set up a shrimp boil for us while the other captains brought back a yellowfin tuna and the largest scamp grouper I've ever seen. And I'm not lying when I tell you this entire trip consisted of the best seafood I've had in my entire life. After eating until I was uncomfortable and talking with the rest of the guys there, it was time to get some sleep and be ready for day one. Brent and A.A. Ron are going with Michael, okay. not Big Mike, Yep. Uh, or Red's what we call him. Red. That's the first time, and then the afternoon you're going with Brown, which is Steven. Okay. Red and Brown. What's going on, everyone? So day one here at the Redfish Lodge in Louisiana, going out with Aaron from A-Benz right here. We're going to be on a boat. We're gonna be targeting some big redfish, throwing some Strike King lures. So we're gonna be with two different captains today. We'll talk about them, see, pick their brains on different things, and see if we can get on some big fish. So let's get out there. Aaron and I started the day with Captain Michael Frenette, also known as Red, and the anticipation was at an all-time high as we left the lodge along with the other three captains. After a short run, we all crossed the mighty Mississippi River to get us to the gold mine. All right guys, tied up a little jig head right here. Put on a flood minnow by Strike King. Just tied up straight braid, don't need a leader here. And we're gonna see if we can do a little sight fishing, maybe a little blind casting, and you can see it's tight quarters right here, so this will be exciting. Oh, there's one. That's a big one. Big trick. Yeah. Step on that one. Well, all right, that's what we're doing today. So they just be like flowing through right now. What's that? The reds. They're gonna be kind of stationed up. Hard to tell. Yeah, sometimes they're dropping with that tide and they're rolling out all these little pockets. Yeah. But usually a little dead end pocket like this is good for one to three fish every time. Okay. There ain't one right here, I can tell you that. That water is golden. Oh, there is one right here. Oh. Yep, there you go. Get another one. Oh, I dropped mine. You got him. Got him. Got him right there. One I lost he came straight out of the grass. Isn't that awesome? Look at this other one well, right here, small guy. They're just flooding out right now, and he just ate. Look at this. This is Damn just, hell. you're just dropping jigs and smoking them right now. Go to the back for one second. Hey, nice work, fellas. Yeah. We'll just sit here for a second. Dude, that bigger one I lost was coming out. That was an eight, nine pounder. Yeah, that was a good one. Right. She said. All right, so I got a good one right here. This guy's got a sweet. I told you there'd be some back here. Oh, yeah. Right? Look at that blue tail on him. Yeah, he said it's good for three, and guess what? We saw three of them. Dude, they were just flowing out of the grass. That was crazy. I was literally like, well, there's none in here. Oh, there they are. Yep. Oh, there we go. Open my bail too early. There we go. Dude, that's picture perfect right there. My first Louisiana redfish. Super orange right there. Very blue tail. 
Yeah, that's picture perfect, just the one spot. Dude, what a freaking pretty red, man. So orange coming out of that grass. Yeah. Oh, little guy, little guy right here, right by the boat, right under us. Yep. He got him, look at that! <laughs> Dude, I just looked down, I'm like, hey, there's one right there. <laughs> Dude, they eat. They eat. They are hungry here. That is so cool. All right, get yours in. Pretty good little swim bait right here. It really does imitate like a small little mullet or a mud minnow. And as you saw, those reds wanted it. Why you working your red fish magic that way? There's a small one. Big one? What do you think? Right here. Oh yeah, that's the same as you got him. Good job. There we go. Nice work. Come on over here. A little bit smaller than the first one, but sight fishing them like that, just so oh, sick. Oh, epic. <laughs> and they're so hungry. <laughs> like, you put a bait in front, like, they're gonna hit. They're ferocious. Yeah, another salt slot fish. And the slot here in Louisiana is uh, 16 to 27, you're saying, right? Yeah, that's it. There you go, so it's a little different, but. Another good so fish. Bad. Yeah, that's a beautiful little guy right there. He's got a little beat up tail. He's not as picture perfect. Still Get a release on him. See you, dude. All right, just tied on a little redfish magic here. One of these flood minnows on here, too. Look at that pocket. Oh, yeah. We got a big old red right here. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. It, you got him. Holy oh, my shit, God. That's a freaking tank, bro. <laughs> you get, get him. Oh, he got me in the grass. Bad now. That's why we use the heavy braid. <laughs> See the shoulders on that thing. Get him in there. That's a good one. Hey, good job, man. That's a huge one, bro. Yeah, that's a solid one right there, man. If you get a, a, a good bait like the flood minnow in front of their face within a foot or two, they're going to track it down and do the hard work for you. So it didn't have to be a perfect cast, but he's a beautiful fish. Barely enough for him to get by. Look, big red right there. Decent size here coming at you. Right behind the flow yeah, muscle. Right. Oh. Right there. Yeah. There's no you got, got him right there. That ain't too bad. Right, th one right under us. Saw. Just trying to get you a triple. There we go. Nice little pocket back here. Okay, Captain putting us on. All right, who's the bigger? Real question. It's gonna be close. Oh, my bad. This is a freaking butterball. Oh, that's a chub. Yeah, look how chubby that guy is. He's got a couple little little spots on his back right there. Five spotter. Yours is a little bigger, bro. Yeah, he's got a gut. Yours got a gut on him, too. You, dude. Oh, there's, a, there's one. Dropping. Yep, yep, he's coming. You got him. Got him. There we nice, go. Dude. Awesome. Thank you. Nice, uh, he just like turned sideways and flashed like a mullet would. Right hey, dude, how you doing? Woo. Yeah, the only reason I saw him is he turned and flashed like a mullet. And I'm like, that's not a mullet. It did yeah. look like a mullet that one, too. He was a little brighter. Yeah. Dude, yeah, they're liking this, uh, this little spinner bait, the Redfish Magic. Crush, I've never thrown them before in. You've never thrown them before? No. I've seen them. I've seen them in the stores all the time, but. Yeah, it's all little guy. It's all slot fish right there. It's so much fun. See you, dude. That was a good little first half. Yeah. After a solid morning with Captain Red, all the boats met up to eat some lunch together, talk about the fish we had caught, and switch people amongst the captains. For a second half, we were paired with Captain Steven Frenet, also known as Brown. We were going to continue throwing a red fish magic while sight fishing, and this is when the bite really decided to turn on. Big old gar. Yeah, I got that gar. <laughs> well, yeah, he kind of smoked it. I mean, he freaking throttled that thing. Oh, what a jump! <laughs> Is that an alligator? 
Yeah. Wow, that gator might, gar? might be my first he's gator guard. Huh? No, he's got that short nose on him. Yeah, it's like dark. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. Well, thank you, sir. Absolutely. Here we go. <laughs> I was just burning it back. I'm like, oh, look, guard. Ding. I'm like, all right. To the right, you know, it might be a stingray. I don't know, but yeah, you're right on him. Oh, sh no, you're good. You're good. I think we got each other. Is that a fish? Yeah, it's a red. He's chasing you down. He's chasing you. Got it. Got yeah, it's point. a big one. Here's that big one. Yes, sir. Dude, you called him out. Yes, sir. That was a big one. Okay, let me get out of your way. Yeah, you're good. Done. Nicely done, yeah. my friend. <laughs> hey, good eyes, though. Yeah. I looked up. I'm like, yeah, you're right. Yeah, that's one. Come on over here. At first, I thought it was a stingray. It's so wide. Like, his tech fins are so wide. I was like, is that a stingray? Did yeah. Bait pass? And I said, oh, my God. That might be a on on bro. Yeah. Turn on you. There's another one right here. It's either no, you? no, that's not me. That's another one. Yeah, you got him. Where at? He's gonna get it right here. He's gonna get it right here. Yep, ate oh, it. <laughs> He's in this patch right here, but I'm pulling him, getting him close. Oh yeah. Alright, come on, stop bullying me, man. You don't have to do it to me like that. I'm half battling the fish, half battling my grass. <laughs> Come on over. Louisiana Marsh, yep. Come on over here. Look how orange this guy is. That's big, bro. I hear him already drumming. You so hear that? He I heard him drumming ten feet away from the boat. Yeah, I got him. Oh yeah, that's a solid one. Look how freaking orange he is. Ow! He's in. <laughs> nice work. Let's go, dude. Let's go. That's big, bro. Here. That's such a pretty fish. Mm. Beautiful yeah. Fish. Yeah, I got him. He's still hooked on the line. Yep. So that. That's why that, you come to Louisiana. That is why you come to Venice right there, the Redfish Lodge right there. Yeah. Look at that. You got the little Redfish Magic, the, was that the Flood Minnow? The Flood Minnow. Flood Minnow uh, hanging on there. There he goes. See you, dude. Here you go. Cool. Yep. Nice work, Let's bro. go, dude. Got one. Oh boy. Blind cast. Oh, boy. oh, see you, Dave. <laughs> oh, oh, that's a better one. Oh, oh, my base messed up, but we're gonna try. Yep, you're good. There you go. I knew there had to be a couple back in this little pocket. Just sitting in there. Yeah. Look too damn good. Oh, there we go. As soon as I casted that. I got a bass. Green bass. I got a bass. Get on over here. Oh, they're beautiful. And this is what's Ooh, cool about fish. Louisiana here. Hey, boy. this is the best part. You want to see this double right here? My man's got a large mouth. <laughs> we just got that in the same spot right there. Pretty red and a large. Welcome. That's to cool. That's cool. See you, dude. Oh, you got him. Nice you got him. <laughs> hey, that is a new PB, bro. So don't. I'm not believing any of that. Yeah. I agree, bro. Now, I have found where trout. There's another blackie right here. Is there? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Right now. Everybody's on him. Got him. Yep. He'll eat. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I guess it's my turn. Yep. Go around. All right. <laughs> Little sleigh ride. We just had another uh, black Phew. show up. Brent put ah. a freaking redfish magic on his face. <laughs> this one looks like it's fighting harder again. All right. Look for another one. Double up, boys. This is so cool. Black drum on an artificial right here on the redfish magic. He just smoked it. That's one's a little smaller. He's got his stripes. This is fun. It's always a blast when you can sight fish any sort of fish and to get one that eats to eat an artificial that normally doesn't like that. That's so cool. A little little mini bridge beast right here. But we are not in the bridges. Or like something along those lines. Yeah. You know? Dude, that's such a that, like to see it hanging out of his Crazy, mouth like huh? that. Right. That's just <laughs> wild to me. Like, I had him get him by accident, I swear. But this is like no, no, no. We're, we're, seeing we're them watching it this happen, bro. Yeah. yeah. Look at this. You gonna release on this guy? Oh, he was ready to go. See you, dude. He took off. Uh, is this a school of them right here? How far? Oh yes, yes. Spot on. Drag it through him. You're about to get whacked. Got him. There's like, oh, I dropped it. 
put it all right in there, Aaron. I'm going. I think they went right, yep. I could have left it at my ball, right in front of it. Yep. Got him. Got him right there. Drug it over his back. Yeah. Back and got He's it. like, oh, some scratched my back. That felt nice. <laughs> Come on over here, dude. That's not a bad one. No. <laughs> That's a damn good one. They're doing so oh, sick. Man, good eyes. I just looked over and saw orange. I'm like, uh. uh yeah. And when you said it, like, is that a school? I saw like four little white tails. Yep. Come on. Come on over. Oh, yeah. He's, he saw everyone else's line. He's like, hey, let's, let me help the homies. Well, Aaron, we suck. <laughs> I, uh, we all got hit and I just. Come on up. Come on. Yeah, these are all red. Dirty yeah. Get that from there. That was a good eye on Brent's part. Great eye. <laughs> Get out. Dude, they just want to be under the boat. They do this over by me too. It's so annoying. There we go. I haven't caught red in so long. Yeah, that's a solid fish. That is not. Come on over here, my guy. Oh, that's a tournament fish right there. Oh, oh yeah. All right, you ready to see how perfect tournament fish this is? Yeah, for all you tournament watchers, let's see where he fits. Ah, uh, head over. A 27 and a half. Still a good fish. Yeah, I thought he was right there I for him. Too. That's awesome. He's beautiful. Like, Another like picture perfect, single spot on each side. Yeah, not to mention like the whole fishing scenario. It's all it's all, yeah. Ah, get a release on this to, guy. We tried to poach your, your spot there for the we weren't <laughs> able to get him. Oh man, we're like we gotta find the rest of those. Oh, here's one. Here's one. Where? Right here. You got him. I see. There's also one right here. There's two right here. One's about to eat you. Yep, there's his. Oh, oh missed him. Getting hit. Oh yeah, I'm coming with you, Brent. <laughs> yep. Oh what? You just had him do the swing and a miss. around it. Swing and a miss. Oh, there's three right here. Four. Oh, he just nipped at my tail. What is happening? There's three to the left too, Brent. Chaos. Dude. Look right there. You had him in the water. Look. Oh, he swam up next to me. He's a denier. Yeah. Where'd he, the other four go? He hit. Oh, here's one. Little guy. Yeah, there was three or four little guys right next to him. Oh, he can't help himself. Oh, oh. he can. All right. Hey, I'm playing two fakes. Well, those are my first real. There's one. Yep, yeah, that's a better one, huh? Straight up denial. I might have just spooked them all out of this grass, and they're oh, just they're like. Oh, they're all over. Oh, oh. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> that was sick. <laughs> I was like, he's Is like. He gonna? <laughs> another one. You see him like grab it yeah, and then just let go? Oh, him. yep. Yeah, Brent, you on him? A little to the left. Oh, right on his nose. To watch that one eat, watch yours eat right there. Dude, he had it by like half the tail and then just. And like, then he just waited. And he. So you're gonna do something with that or you're gonna spit it out? You know? Because right yeah. now, if I set the hook, it's pointless. Yeah. He's that was just, perfect. He's just, he's just, he's just so much mullet, right here, right in front, right in front. How many? One? Yep. A two, two. Two? You got him. Got him. Yeah, that's a good one. There's two of them, at least. <laughs> oh, one's on. Good eyes, Brent. Thank you. I mean, hey. That's the other one, I think. You get him to eat right next to the boat, that'd be sick. And there's one in front. There's a big one in front, Aaron. Right here. Right, I can't. I wish I could straighten my rod. Here. Oh, there's two of them. There's two of them. This is just, this is too much fun, honestly. Yeah, I mean, this is called knocking them out the park. Yeah. Up there. Dude, he choked this thing. Come on over here. I got another plus a upper slot, maybe a little over. Probably. Yeah. Right over. Probably. Yeah. yeah. Look. The whole swim oh, bag like part. You're like just gone. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, he choked that thing. 
Perfect cast. Thank you. Uh, I have one Got it up. Got it. I said, don't reach that long. That swim bay part of that. Dude, yeah, that's a 30. Perfect. Like, that's a, that's like, that. yeah, that's probably like right at 30, maybe like 31 if I had yeah. to guess. Beautiful fish. Get a release on him. Watch that gator. There he goes. See you, dude. Nice work. Hey, thank you. Absolutely. We've gone like all like 30 seconds and hadn't seen one. I'm starting to get nervous. I gotta get a good one. I haven't broke the uh, over. Oh, right here, right here. Where? Tail. Um, yeah, two, of them, right two, of them, two of them, two of them, two of them, two of them. Yep. Back out the water, boy. Yeah. Get in there, Brent. Oh my god, dude. I don't necessarily see them, but they're somewhere. I got whacked. Me and Brent. That <laughs> one came all the way up to the surface, stuck his head out the water. Yeah. I thought it was a garfish. There you go. There he is. Nice work. Not the overslot, but. No, it wasn't. It was no. not. There was two there for sure, and you got the one that stuck his head out of the water. Yep. Yeah. This is a boat clipper. Okay, I'll take them all. Yeah. Big or small. It's the tug. The drug is the tug. There's one. The little there guy. There you go. There you go. Oh, it, was just, it was like five feet from the boat. That another gator. Where's it? Oh, yeah. Oh, good release. Nice. Like, are there one? And one literally like floated his ass. Oh no, there's a couple of reds. There's a school of reds, right where I'm casting. Oh yeah, yep, yep. Am I in it? No, a little too low. He's right across the heart of him. He should get hit now. Yep. <laughs> Still there? Uh, I literally don't, I saw him for a half a second, made the cast and it, oh, oh they're going to the right, they're going to the right. Too. Yeah, but there's one out here too. I have no idea how big this one is. Oh, oh he I hit me, he hit me. Oh, I'm oh, dude, there's like spinning 10, on a bro. chair. Yeah, there's, I'm there's, there's, on a chair. there's, there's spinning. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm spinning in a chair. All right, nice little we'll double up right there. Oh, little boat flipper. Are they over by him? You got a better one. Cute little guy right there. See it, dude? Yeah, dude. There was like ten. Yeah, bro. there's like that I was saw that school. Ten yards too far to the left. What? There it is. Yeah. There's two or three in there. I like it. Got him. Got one. Doubles. Oh, dude, there's a bunch. You see that? Yeah. They flicked up. This is sick. All right, we found a little pocket of them right here. Can we get a third? Oh. Triple up. Oh, oh, five pounder. Oh, yeah, that one's a good one. Mm -hmm. It's got a gun on him. Both of them better than that one that got off, or that I had. Yeah. First. There we go. Yeah, I'm putting it on us right there. I never did get Beautiful redfish. Red See you, dude. I feel like a bit of allergies. I never get them. Only when I go north. Oh, dude, big drum, big drum. Giant drum. He is on the move. Yeah, he is. See if he likes the chartreuse. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. He's coming back, he's coming back. There's a red. He's coming, look for it. Oh, that's a gar. That's a gar. Nice freaking work. You got him? Yeah. There you go, dude. Another nice one for work. you. Dude, that's Great another work. stud. Oh, dude. Hey, what? Why was that drum moving at like 20 miles an hour? I don't have a clue. He was on the move for something. Oh, yeah. The water's almost gone. I think about 430. I'll probably bag like 145. Oh, there we go. Red. There we go. Little red. I'm like in the background, I'm like, <laughs> see you dude. Dude, there's something there, you see that? That push? No, it's a freaking Yep, yeah, that's a big red, that's a big red. You're gonna hit it, you're gonna hit it right there. Huge red. Oh my God. Dude, that might be, that might be it. That's a huge one. Dude, you. I'm putting the pole down, Aaron, so bear with me, it's gonna swing to the left. Yep. All right, bro. All right, I'm grabbing the camera for you. And this is my. This is a very large redfish, guys. I'm trying to just chill out, play light. You got nowhere to go. 
Dude, you have the perfect cast. I still haven't got a good look. I know it's my biggest of the day. Yeah. I'm gonna let her pick what size. She, okay, it's pretty big. <laughs> yeah, dude. I'm gonna let her pick what size she wants to go on. Yeah, it's typically what we gotta do. Oh, yeah. Unreal, dude. She chose this side. Yeah. The head on that thing, it looks like a black drum. Not giving up. Not giving up at all, man. All right, I think she's ready for a cap. Death there you go. Look at that thing. That's a good one. Oh yeah, man. That's the freaking redfish magic striking right in the corner of the mouth, dude. Absolutely Look at that thing perfect. just hanging there. That is a big red. My biggest in literally over 10 years. I have awesome, caught a redfish <laughs> like that since I was 14. That's pretty damn cool. That's yeah, that's awesome, sick, dude. dude. Oh, she was ready to go immediately. Oh uh, yeah, still had some in them. Oh yeah. Hey, nice work, buzzer bro. beater. Amazing day one. We got back to the lodge and enjoyed some fresh yellowfin tuna and red snapper for dinner while exchanging fish stories from the day with the other guys. We knew the forecast was calling for stronger winds the following day, getting up to 20 mile an hour at times, but that didn't stop us from getting back out on the boats for day two. The game plan was the same. We were going to be sight fishing reds in the marsh. Our first half of the day was with Captain Max Martin. We started the morning in a saltwater pond that reminded me more of bass fishing than any other saltwater fishing I've ever done. A little bit different bait than we used yesterday. Yesterday we were using their swim bait, the flood minnow. This is more of a little creature bait. It's called the Raging Menace. Kind of looks like a little, uh, maybe like a little crab to them. Maybe just some sort of crustacean. You can rig it this way or you could do it kind of vertical like that. And these will flutter in the water just like a bait fish too, so. We'll see what happens. Then there's already a fish. Right. Oh, yep, yep, yep. You got him. You got him. You're a cat. Oh. He smoking? No. He went for mine. He like turned. On yeah, him. he left mine. Went for yours. That was a tank. Yeah, that was a big one. Wow, we've been here for thirty seconds. Yep. Oh. He, he, he definitely watched. Yeah, I saw the head wake. <laughs> <laughs> a little trigger happy over here. A little bit. Gotta get warmed up, bro. Is that him moving away? Probably, See that wake? Probably so. No, I wasn't recording. I was... Yeah, I was just on the bottom, huh? No, I like, I swear like three inches under the surface, just jigging it along. And he smoked it. What? <laughs> well, I had a good grip on that rod. Thank you, sir. Were you just like dragging it? Like yeah, dragging it like four inches under the surface, just popping it, and it got hammered in my hand. Oh, there, little jig head, menace. He smoked it. Can't confirm, they like it. Here we go. Awesome little red. See, dude? <laughs> that was different. We don't even have sun right now. Like, look at this little gap. We're pushing a Pathfinder through right now. Yeah, we can do wind and sun, that's cool. No. Oh, yep, yeah. yep, yep, yep. Good eye. Nice, dude. Oh, I wasn't recording, dude. There you go. That's a nice one. Here, it's broken. 
Yeah. Off, dude. The wind definitely made it harder for us on day two. After lunch, we switched over to Captain Mike Frenette's boat, a local fishing legend and owner of the lodge. Sunscreen, man. It's like sweating out of my face and in my eye. Yep. Hell. That's that burns. It burns. There's a right fish. 12 o'clock. Going to, or is that a drum? Just went around that piece of grass, right? See him? Coming out? I see him. I see him. Yep, you got it. No, he's to the left. Way he just went right past me, didn't he? What I saw was way to the left. Then there must have been two. There was for sure one there. Yeah, I saw the one you were casting at. I, I thought that was a pretty well placed cast. Yeah, no, I was looking at a complete different one. There's a big drum right here. Yeah, I see it. You got it? You got it. Oh, dude, that's a stud. That's a big one. All right, that's, yeah, that's a good one. Dude, that's sick. Oh, does he now? By the tail? <laughs> Let me tell you something. This goes back to my college days. Oh, uh, makes sense. We just got this big, nasty. Captain Mike called it out. It's a big black drum. And man, let me tell you, they love these spinners. Captain Mike's son, they call him Captain Red, was telling me that they think they're crabs. And man, if you're from Florida, you know these guys are pretty picky. They like their crabs, sometimes cut bait, shrimp. But over here, you put the spinner in their mouth, they're eating. She's got to be over 25 pounds, yes, I think. that's a 30 pound. Guys, what a freaking beautiful fish. If you don't respect big black drum, <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> That's the truth. A lot of people, ah. Yeah. But, and me, I don't care what it is if it's biting my hook. Yeah. Fish that size? Yeah. They say that until they hook it. Hey. I've heard Good fish. job, man. Vibrating swim jig. Hey, I love vibrating swim jig. There you go. There we go. I saw that. That was epic. Yep. Good job. Right on the other side of that little creek over there. Now you get to bring him through the jungle. Oh, you you ready to see it? Bring him through the jungle, boy. Guys, Brent just blind casted right the mouth here and like the minute smoke. Just like that. Through the trees. I'll go over here. Hey, dude. How you doing? Thanks for playing. Let's make you famous. Right there. The yeah, well, you're Who's getting action. Back, you're too. just you're just swinging and missing. Yeah, there is on the back too. Miss, so we got that raging strike menace two. right there hanging from his lip on that uh, redfish magic. It's a killer combo over here. Beautiful fish. That's just a picture perfect red right there with the blue tail, the single spot. That's an awesome fish. Get a release on him. See you, dude. Good red. Oh yeah, dude. Nice. They do exist. Oh yeah. He will. You keep right out the mud hole. I didn't say fish on because it felt like I just looked the earth. Man. Yeah. That's a little drag for you. Yeah, she took a really good stream around over here. She's big. Though. Yeah. She's gotta be 28 to 30. Oh, she's over 30. If this doesn't make you want to come to the Redfish Lodge, Louisiana, I don't know what does. And if this doesn't make you subscribe, I also don't know what does. Probably like a 34, 35 inch beautiful fish, blue tail, one spot, picture perfect, man. Captain called the mud ball, put the spinner bait there, the Redfish Magic by Strike King, and we got a freaking gorgeous fish. Absolute stud. Thank you for playing. Unreal, they're so resilient, man. He's out, dude. You're crushing it today. The cast. Huge shout out to the Redfish Lodge of Louisiana and all the captains for the amazing experience and also Saltwater Sportsman for inviting me out on this trip. If you want to see more videos from this shoot and other trips, check out the link listed down in the description.